Hi everybody, it's David Fleming here from the Toronto Realty Group and welcome to your September market update. Now an interesting thing happened in the month of August, folks, as you can see here, prices rose on average 0.8% from July to August. Now you might remember last year, right? And we saw a massive increase in prices and you're saying, well, David, why is this interesting? That was an outlier. That was a pandemic infused summer market. All the inventory and all the sales that we lost in the spring due to the pandemic played out in the summer. We are not used to seeing prices rise in the summer. This could be very telling as we move into the fall. So year over year, guys, a 12.6% increase. We are completely in line with the 12.6% increase that we saw in July. So sales activity is slipping down 8.5% month over month. We have seen a steady decline in sales from the peak of the spring. Now, if you're looking at the year over year number and you're seeing a 20% drop, you're gonna say, well, hold on, you're talking about prices increasing in the fall. We just saw a 20% drop in sales. Remember, August of 2020, the most sales in any August in the history of Toronto real estate seems to reason we're going to see a drop in 2021. Now, inventory is where things get very interesting in my opinion, because we're seeing inventory continue to slide month over month down 15.5% for new listings, but over 40% year over year, that can't continue if we're looking for prices to ease. So active listings down 15.5% month over month, it's over 50%, a drop of 50% year over year. Is it any wonder why prices are increasing? So we saw an average home price of a million seventy off the peak of 1.1 million, but we usually see a bigger drop in the summer. We didn't see that this year. Put that together with the inventory numbers, guys, and I think if we don't see a massive surge in inventory this fall, unfortunately, and don't shoot the messenger if you're a buyer, I see prices continuing to rise. So folks, whether you're a buyer or a seller in this market, hang on to your hats. I think it's going to be a very, very busy three months.